We're here today at the Nokia Arena for the XR and 5G millimeter wave hackathon challenge. We're here with our first dev kit of the Snapdragon Spaces XR developer platform. All the developers here are using these kits to bring their ideas to life through augmented reality. Nokia is providing the 5G millimeter wave equipment here at the arena. XR really requires high quality connectivity and, and thus 5G millimeter wave is a really important technology. We are looking for what developers will do with a combination of these technologies. So Hackathon is basically a really creative way to come up with solutions in a short amount of time. Challenges were given well ahead, then the best teams and ideas were brought together in the Hackathon, which is 48 hours. They have to adopt new technologies in a short amount of time, and they also have to kind of think about their solutions, how to actually bring value for the customer. I was thinking about your presentation perspective, um, that you have to be really, really precise on how to present the, um, the perspective. What are your like, opinions? Why would you buy this solution? Our project is about uh, using augmented reality in public transport. Bus driver has an interface which lets them know in advance that there is a passenger who needs assistance. Our project is about art and how you can view uh, Tampere from different eyes. So the problem we're trying to tackle is to make your marketing more engaging and interactive for consumers. Hello, so we are Team X Art. We are targeting the primary users are from artists and to citizens. And we are operating on three platforms. So our idea is to bring uh, joyfulness and interactivity and community into exercising and especially to running. So we also found out that the revenue from AR ads will increase in the coming years. Our app enables people to listen and record and leave messages in parks in Tampere. These messages can be public, left for anyone to listen to, or they can... We've seen some amazing presentations and demos, and now the jury is deliberating on who will actually win the whole hackathon. Uh, one thing you may not know is that this was the, the first Spaces hackathon that we've brought the devices to. So it was a, a first journey for us, and uh, we're really, really excited and impressed to see how much you were able to do with the kit. I would like to welcome here uh, the winner, the first position, which is awarded to Team XART. I think the winning team, they really had thought out, outside of the box. The idea that they have is, is something that the city has been thinking, thinking about already, so there is a clear need for that kind of solution. It's not just the winning part, what I loved is the whole experience. So I think we learned a lot about a lot of other technologies which we weren't familiar with before. Thank you everybody and see you again in some of our next programs.